Okay, welcome back. We are looking at PP Pepe 2.0. Um, did just spawn in. So before you get into the video though, if you guys could leave a like, comment, sub, all that fun stuff. Really helps the channel grow. Really do appreciate it. Let's me know that you guys would like to see me cover PP 2.0 more. And it gives me a fist bump. It's like giving me a fist bump. Um anyway. Outside of that, let's get it right on into the video. So we are currently on the five minute time frame as you guys can see right here and basically we do have a triangle forming right here you have one or two scenarios i'd look at this and more often than not be like hey rising wedge now however uh we did make a new high right here so what i would guess i would say is if you end up breaking really where that point of control is at then i think you probably end up nuking down lower um if not if not the last line in the sand is going to be right there which is at uh what do you call it however many zeros three seven five six so basically these two spots which poc is at well we actually want it a little bit lower than poc so it's basically just that low that's at 4886 um say i say you still have a chance if you maintain this first one but uh if you break the second one by any means at all then 100 percent you're just like gonna drop um otherwise this as long as we maintain like that bullish market structure then we pretty much should be able to zoom up uh the first like major targets that i would kind of look for following from here would actually be uh right here which is at your 50 level slash 618 50 is at 6765 618 is at 7204 which from where we currently reside is roughly about a 20 percent move so um yeah pp 2.0 does doesn't look super bearish but uh yeah so other than that none of this is financial advice these are all just my thoughts and opinions and you guys have a phenomenal day as always adios muchachos